As we've reported, the groundbreaking for a new parking structure for the McCallum Police Department, constructing to alleviate, that is, the current congested parking lot. CBS 4's Michelle Vargas has more on how the department was able to pay for the structure without having to use taxpayer money. Finding a parking spot at the McAllen Police Department can be difficult sometimes, and especially right now, as the department is getting ready to build a structure that will alleviate the current congestion. We will add about 136 parking spaces for this particular parking lot. You know, when we have about 230, that's almost, uh, you know, improving it by 50% or so more. So, so we're, uh, we're, we're excited about that. But in the meantime, in the meantime, we have this parking situation that you were, experienced, uh, were exposed to today. But there is a temporary downside to the project. Due to the construction, for the next nine months, employees who used to park in the back lot will have to take up spaces in the front or at the municipal park. But Chief Rodriguez says the project will benefit the community for the next 20 to 25 years. The community should know that this is about a $4 million project. Uh, but it is coming at no cost to them. This, this is um, uh, going to be paid for entirely from um, forfeited assets, that is funds from uh, assets we have forfeited over the years. Well, it's a very expensive parking lot, whether it's with taxpayer or whatever, it's a, it's a lot of money. And just in that parking lot doesn't make sense to me. To meet the needs of a growing city, the police chief says parking needs to be expanded. We couldn't find ground space that was um, cost effective for us to buy and convert it into parking spaces. So the alternative was to build up. It's not the wisest way to spend your money because it's more expensive to build up than it is, you know, basically pour asphalt over ground. Uh, but that's the best we could do. I know it's getting, McAllen's getting a little bit congested, so we need ways to find out how to improve it. Reason why, Rodriguez says, the project comes at a time of great need. We are building a structure over a current, uh, basically, ground structure. So we have ground parking lot. We're building over this without impacting the ground. In other words, we're not losing parking spaces on the bottom. Basically, we're able to have a, a, a roof over some of our units, some of our more critical units. In McAllen, Michelle Vargas, CBS 4 News and ValleyCentral.com. And the city commission had to review and approve the plans for the parking garage before they gave the police department the green light to start construction.